twist it. I'm twisting this as fast as I can, y'all. I'm trying to. What's up, everyone? My name is Lehua, and welcome to the Superfina channel. I have been doing some reviews and videos about Razor's Quartz Collection. And if you haven't seen it before, I did do a video about doing mic testing on Razor's Siren X. This one over here. Yes, I was doing some experiments test because I was having some difficulty and I decided to record it just so I can get some feedback and then I just did a compilation of everything that way everyone else would know what I went through and everything I did and a lot of you guys had some questions like you guys were asking about what software I was using what I was using to like hold the Siren X and I was wondering like why are you asking about the arm and I realized that a lot of like arms or mics don't fit this part over here it doesn't fit you need an adapter so i'm gonna be talking about that in this video we're gonna talk about the arms and how to connect this beautiful thing to them because y'all like to use this a lot of people like the siren x especially y'all who love the pink words uh this bump yes 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 we all like razor's pink we all like the color, okay? It is the best thing Razer ever made. I'm super, super biased. <laughs> and by the way, if you don't know who I am, I'm Lehua Superfina. I review tech, games, manga. I make candy masks. And if you like that kind of stuff, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell so you can be notified on the next video. I also stream on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Lehua Superfina. So let's get with the Siren X. All right, everyone. So y'all were asking me what I was using to hold the Siren X. I was using this arm right here. This is the newer. If you want to know where you can get that, I'll leave a link in the description. I bought this on Amazon. And if you guys notice over here, this is the part people are like wondering, how the F are you going to connect this? So if you notice over here, the lock don't match with the key. <laughs> so what you need is an adapter, also known as male-female adapter. So this thing here has a female and a male section, male part. So if you notice over here, the Siren X's um, female part does have a wider diameter. So you need an adapter that matches. I'll have a link for the adapter too. You can buy this on Amazon, but you can also buy this at a music store because there's a lot of different sizes of mics and adapters are needed. So what you're going to do is you are going to hold on to the Siren X. Here's the female part. You're going to get this male part and you are going to connect it. So you're just going to twist, 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 twist. There you go. There you go. You twisted it. Okay, so now we got the right female part to match with this male part. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to put this on top. We're going to twist it. Is it righty tidy? Not this one. It's lefty loosey. All right. So here we go. I'm going to show this to you guys. Twist it, twist it, twist it. I'm twisting this as fast as I can, y'all. I'm trying to. I'm trying to twist this as fast as I can. Okay, so this is the part where you want to twist it. This part here, not this part. This part. So you're going to twist this part because this is the part that's actually being connected. And there you go. This is what I was using to hold the Siren X during my test. Another question people had was, how are you using it as a boom mic? So I use boom mic as a example. Cause you know how like in movies or uh, recording sets, they have like the mic like this above the people so they can talk out of it or talk and then it'll just pick up the sound. So during the test, I was doing that so it wouldn't pick up the static noise. So it'd be like right above over, like, right above over here of me. If you can see, like you can vaguely, barely see. So I was having it like right above me, like so. 
the arm over here, this part, it's connected to this. This part over here, it goes like this, like so. And fortunately for me, I have shelves right behind my camera. So I was just attaching this to a shelf behind, behind, <laughs> or on the side, or on the side. And I was using this part to grab onto the shelf. Now this is super strong. This thing is strong. My shelf was not horizontal. It was actually um, the side of the shelf. So I was like attaching it like so. And it was holding onto the arm. So I attached this to like a vertical part of the shelf, the side of it, so it would hold onto the arm. And that's how I was able to position the Siren X above me like a boom mic. Like a boom mic. Not exactly a boom mic, but like a boom mic. There's a difference. Boom mics are hella more expensive because they're awesome. They don't pick up any noise except for our voices. They filter out really good. You don't need that much software. They're just phenomenal. They already... It's, that's a whole other thing. I'm not familiar with boom mics. Why? Because I don't have one! Shoot! I would have more knowledge about boom mics if I had one. Everyone who saw the video of me doing test experiments with the Siren X, if you are wondering how to get this arm and this adapter so they can connect and you can use it and position your Siren X however you want, if you do not want to have to just place your Siren X somewhere in front of you, in front of your computer, if you want more flexibility, there are going to be links for the arm and adapter if you really really want to get one and you want to know where to get it or what I got exactly because it's been working for me it is available in the description below it's there you're welcome <laughs> if you guys like this video don't forget to give this a like if you have any more questions uh, concerns or comments if you guys want to share your experience with the siren X share them leave Leave them in the comments below. We also have a Discord. Some people have been contacting me through Discord. Link is available in the description. Y'all have been awesome with communicating with me in the comments. You guys have been asking really good questions. If you guys want to see more videos about the Siren X, just let me know. Let me know what you want to know. The only thing is, is the software because I didn't use a certain software for the Siren X. I just use the software through XSplit. But if you have questions on how I use that through XSplit, you can ask that. I also stream playing video games on Twitch. So if you want to like hang out, talk about stuff, I am available at twitch.tv slash Superfina. I do stream every Tuesday, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Schedule is available on the Twitch channel. Also, if you like manga, I do host podcasts across worlds where we talk about anime and manga and anything related to it. We normally upload a podcast weekly every Saturdays. Keep an eye out on that if you like manga and anime. We have a question for every episode, so don't forget to answer that question. You can leave it in the comments or visit the Discord. The Discord is available in the description below. Link is available. Don't be shy. We're all cool there. Not crazy. It's not intense. <laughs> it's really chill. It's super chill. Super, super chill. Thank you guys for watching this video about the arm and adapter for Razer's Siren X. If you have any questions, comments, or you want to see more stuff, don't forget to subscribe. My name is Lehua. This was the Superfina channel about Razer's Siren X and the arm and adapter. Hope you guys like this. I will see y'all later. Fist bump. Since you're still here, how about leaving a like? And while you're at it, subscribe, ring the bell so you can get notifications. I want to give a huge, huge shout out to my Patreons and channel members because you all have been supporting the Superfina channel and it's not even required. So I really appreciate you. You are all in my heart. If you also want to support the Superfina channel, here's a link to the Patreon along with a list of social media. All the links are available in the description below. 
thank you so much for watching this video. I have much love, much aloha for y'all, and I will see you later.